Welcome to Zara Connect. This is my first informative vlog on how to transfer the funds using the CBQ app. That's a commercial bank. How to share a band in seconds. You need to download this app in your mobile. This is the CBQ app. Click on it. Key in your uh, username and password. This is how the page looks like. Once the password is entered, you will get an OTP which will expire in 5 minutes. Sometimes the OTP is uh, linked uh, to your account and it's it can be keyed in automatically. Otherwise, you need to get it from your messages and key in that OTP. Once uh, this is done, uh, you can key into your account. Uh, once your account is opened, on the right hand side, topmost right hand side, you can see Share IBAN, which is not visible here. But uh, click on the Share IBAN, and you can see this QR code, which you can share to your friend. yes via whatsapp and they need to just import it to transfer the funds i will just show you right away how it happens on the other side how to import the qr code now go back to the whatsapp messages your friend might have sent you the QR code just click on it and it's better to save it uh, in your gallery so it will be easier to import it uh, into your CBQ account once after saving it just go back to your account click on the local transfers import the QR code and once you are importing the QR code you are actually adding the beneficiary you need not type anything the details will be automatically entered addition success that means the beneficiary is already added now into your CBQ account automatically with all the account details, IBAN, everything. Now select that uh, person, click on the transfer, you will get an OTP. Uh, actually, it's authorize. Authorize it, and for the authorization, you need to again get the OTP, which you can get it from your messages. Copy the OTP and uh, go back to your account, key in the OTP so that um, you can get into the account after the authorization is over. So the beneficiary is now authorized after the OTP is keyed in next you can transfer the funds click on the transfer button and select from the list of your beneficiary select the amount go back to your account key in the amount and uh, you can mention it as a personal account or saving account or whatever and just click submit and it's over Thank you for watching.
subscribe my channel for more